Pyramids is good, man. Illuminati Pharaoh shit. In an ancient land, before time or sundials, it was time for a hero. This fall, prepare to believe all over again once more, again. Dragon Brain, prepare to believe. It's a time before time. Oh no, here come the fucking dragons. We need a hero. For 2,000 generations, and a million orcs will storm these lands, and the CGI bill will be apocalyptic! Dragon Brain, prepare to love. I'm only a humble blacksmith with a California accent. How can I possibly rise up and conquer evil without a montage? How indeed do you believe? I believe in the miracle of merchandising. I'll need a furry talking sidekick to spew one-liners while I chop off heads. Don't lose your head! <laughs> we shall spin gold out of this drift. Prepare to sit through a four-hour journey. I've got a quest. I must defeat evil and sell franchise rights to theme parks. You cast the dragons are flying upside down. No! The CG machine is broken again. Dragon Brain! The quest is yours, Dragon Brain. Coming soon to a theater near you. Rated G for gibberish. What's good, one and all? I am Chiliad Kevin here to bring you my next video. Sorry it's been a minute, but I'm spacing some things out just to plan for things. I'm going to Scotland, Edinburgh, Scotland, Rockstar North, September 17th. Here's my credentials. Guys, I got t-shirts. I love 72 Dragon Brain and Surfing the Web. Be my friend. 5550164. I mean, I gave you my phone number already. So guys, let's get into it. The phone number is important. Dragon Brain is important. Dragon Brain is an anagram. First word, Ari Rang. Okay? And uh, the logo for Ari Rang Plaza is 69. 69, guys. Next word, Bond. The phone number is the same as the note. Ari Rang Bond. Ari Rang Bond. I didn't find this anagram, guys. Somebody posted this anagram within a month that the game came out in 2013. Guys, it's so important. I recognize this as an Easter egg and Chiliad mystery. Here's a main clue in GTA 5, Capital of Oro. And here's the brand new James Bond movie, No Time to Die. Calabunga, dude. Here's Dragon Brain. Here's clues that just match up. All these clues match up. You can see the similarities. They're different in different ways. And similar in similar ways. And what's big is small, and what's small is big. And everything is in between. And that's no joke. Look at all this, guys. Here's a sword again with wings. I mean, the, the, the Hornies was a sword. Jane Arthur, guys. I'm going to cover this. It's the only covered up movie star on on Vinewood Boulevard. The Arthur is covered up. We got the the Camelot, San Andreas, guys. Arthur Swords versus the Dark Duth, Nightly at Camelot. Guys, and there's this thing with uh Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh the main character of the the main Rockstar game was Arthur Morgan or King Arthur. The legend of King Arthur, okay, the greatest legend almost of all time. Is it real or not? I'm almost leaning towards real with modern interpretations, okay? Many modern interpretations. Here's the flag of Wales. It's the red dragon, guys. The red dragon versus the white dragon, the English dragon, I should say. England took over. And the Red Dragon is the once and future king who will come back and defeat the White Dragon. I'm going to Scotland and then I'm going to London, England to go to Stonehenge. 
hopefully to slay a, my, a white dragon metaphorically. But guys, let's go over to Arthur Morgan and more red dragons. Arthur Morgan and King Arthur. Wait, you know, I never got confirmation of this, but I always thought Arthur Morgan was uh, inspired from King Arthur and Morgan Le Fay. You know, the kind of duality, you know. Do Morgan, Morgan Le Fay, King Arthur is one of his nemesises. Nemesi. What's the plural of nemesis? Is it nemesi? Who knows? Okay, we're going to do some old stuff and some new stuff. Guys, remember this location at the Beam Me Up Uranus Hill? Guys, see the, the glyph? Well, look at the guy's tattoo on his back. I wonder if I've seen that before anywhere... Anywhere in the game? Whoa! Holy... Grail? It's a red dragon! Guys, it's pretty important. Let's go back to Lester's house. Look at everything you can see in one frame. You got the wizard sleeve, you got the wizard sleeve poster, and you got Dragon 6. Guys, everything is in one frame. Then you got the sword. What's all in one frame, guys? You got the cave, you got the sword. Look at this. Look at this. You got the sword, you got Cry Cave, you got the Obey. What's the, oh, what, is that the, is that Illuminati? Is that a sword? Cry Cave. Is that, is that a UFO? I found something where the UFO crashed. It's been in my old videos. I, I think it's a slayed dragon. We could have, we could have slayed a dragon. We might have to slay a dragon. Guys, they've had all this stuff, though, in the old updates. Uh, I'm going to go into this, though, some more. You know what I'm talking about? It's hard out here in the set. Oh, shit, my nigga. That's nothing. Shit, nigga. I know you done went all Illuminati and shit, you know what I'm saying? Leaving the street niggas in the back, but... Man, that shit is over. Oh, I'm a legitimate businessman now, sister. I'm a CEO, an investor. I'm a Illuminati. I'm a fucking moron, nigga. You should order some more games. Oh, if the wizard's ruined? <laughs> oh, it wrecked any chance I had of getting laid in high school. And I love it. <laughs> They're all classics, and I want them all, but uh, it's your call, obviously. Do you live in the boring suburbs, but dream of living in a lonely castle on a windswept moor? Do you long to trade in your sweatsuit for a hundred pound suit of armor and swap your SUV for a noble stallion? Do you eat microwave dinners? all the while wishing you were roasting a suckling pig at a pagan banquet. Is your next ideal home improvement a moat? Well, get ready, Liberty City! This weekend and every weekend at Liberty City Park, it's the Medieval Millennium Fair. Our band of traveling minstrels, knights, and maidens oh so fair are ready to delight you with tales of the Black Death, witch burnings, and the joys of being a feudal serf. Forget about air conditioning and modern medicine. We've got all the leeches, spells, and potions you need at the Medieval Millennium Fair. Learn the art of cooking with turnips. Yum yum. Buy genuine reproduction medieval artifacts including maces, double-handed battle swords, and one size fits all chain mail. And this weekend only, pick up an authentic mechanical Lady of the Lake in Excalibur. It's perfect for your garden pond or a swimming pool. And learn how to rid your condo of vermin using a penny whistle and a mysterious prancing German named Hans. The Medieval Millennium Fair. Every dragon's eye that I know you found in the, the, the wizard sleeve. Yes, I know what you did with the wizard sleeve. I know, Kevin. <laughs> I know. And for all you fans out there, be sure to visit his YouTube page, Chiliad Kevin. He's got some pretty sweet t-shirts, I heard. Oh, yes. Check it out. <laughs> all right, guys. I want to go over my summer... DLC prediction, uh, maybe winter. Um, the movie DLC could happen. I want to say they're under NDAs, and Michael DeSanta could come back. Uh, King Solomon, King David, Easter eggs. It could be the Mile High Club. They built the casino up. They predicted that. I predicted that. The Mile High Club could could happen. The Playboy Mansion thing could happen. It could happen in Winter Time 2 and the December DLC. I had all these Playboy Mansion Easter eggs to do with the anagram, Little Soul, and the Bay, 
was in the shape of an E to spell Excalibur in a way and it's very interesting but guys this is all I have pretty much um, the year of the dragons though is very important remember Franklin was born in 1988 1988 and then the year 2000 also follows up as the next year of the dragon and that's the millennium and a millennium is a synonym for Chiliad.